Welcome to Swifty Feature of the Month for the month of August 2017. I'm here with Austin Brooks. Austin, how you doing? Good, how are you? Not too bad. We're here at the WIC 338 in Southwick, Massachusetts. Um, one of the finest dirt courses you're going to find around. Austin, I got to ask you, how long have you been riding? Since I was four, I got a dirt bike for my birthday, so I'm 19 now, so about 15 years. Very cool, very cool. Did you have an inspiration or somebody who got you into riding? Uh, no, I think I just saw it on like TV or something, and I wanted one for my birthday, and I got one, so then I just didn't really stop. Very cool. I mean, I always wish that I could ride a motocross bike like you guys out here. I mean, it's crazy to watch. Um, so you said you've been riding for a long time, and you kind of just saw it on TV. Um, <laughs> how many bikes and parts have you been through in your time riding? Uh, I mean, I started off on a 50 and then got a 65, 85, 125, 250, and I mean, dirt bikes break like all the time, so you're always going through parts, and so quite a few. And I got to imagine with, with all the riders out here and the time that you've been doing it, you've probably gotten really close to the people you ride with, right? Oh uh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, all my friends, family, Team Justice, like everyone, we're all close, we help each other out, and it's, it's fun to go to the track, hang out with your friends, and enjoy riding together. Right. And, and obviously, this is right in our backyard, so I know a lot of the riders around here. I know you personally. Um, but could you just kind of explain to whoever might be watching this video what Team Justice is and, and kind of like what you guys do? Uh, Team Justice was started by uh, Officer Bishop uh, in town, and uh, he got a couple other cops and kids who like might not be able to ride based on their family situations or whatnot and we try to help them out by uh, giving them a, a track to ride a bike just something to keep their mind off their life and keep them doing the right thing and uh, yeah definitely officer B and Mrs. B are uh, the biggest part about that without them you know there would be no team justice that's a really great thing you guys got going on and and Officer Bishop's a great guy in general, and uh, I got to give a shout out to Rick, the owner of the track. Um, just a really down to earth, great guy, and um, we're thankful he lets us do this. But so to wrap up this quick interview, um, I usually ask people this, and it's it might require a second of thinking. So, say a, a little kid came up to you and, and asked you and asked you why he should start riding motocross. You know, he's interested in it and he wants to start riding. What would you say to him? Why should he start riding? It's just, it's pretty badass. Like, you know, it's just these guys ripping and it's just, some of these guys are sick and you, know, you, get, you get in great shape. It's very physically demanding and, you know, it keeps your money in places you shouldn't be spending it. It's very expensive and uh, it's just fun to go out on the weekends, either race or ride and, just hang out with your pals. Yeah. Do you have a goal? Do you have a mission when you ride, or you just do it for the love of it? Uh, well, I'm moving up to the A class next next year, so uh, that's going to be a, a tough one to you know run with the big dogs and stuff. But my, mostly my goal is to uh, race the national here in town. That's that's mostly my goal. So hopefully one day. Well, Austin, I want to thank you for giving us a couple minutes of your time. Uh, it's a beautiful day here at the track. Enjoy the rest of your session. Thank you very much. Thank you. Swifty Feature of the Month for the month of August 2017, Austin Brooks. Thank you. Enjoy, my friend.